you can see how incredibly sensitive water is, the surfaces of water are. All these upwellings and these little capillary waves moving through each other. Um, and one can imagine at night when you can see the phosphorescence that there are these rings of phosphorescence that are going under the bridge. Um, it's a great favorite. But there are many, many different wave patterns here and um, forms really of water flow. Turbulent, laminar, and everything in between. large forms, very tiny, tiny, tiny uh, little ripples. And it's all telling a story. Uh, and often at the edges of a flow, you'll see these vortices uh, because there's two bodies of flow, one could say and one is moving faster than the other. And so these vortices and vortex streets or vortex trains uh, are generated. You can see why this is uh, an extraordinary laboratory.